Special Agent Fox Mulder here and we're down at Morwell at the Hazelwood North End of town we're about 160 kilometres southeast of uh, Melbourne in Victoria Australia and we're waiting for the Australian paper mill train which is coming from down that way and it'll be heading around that corner there to join the main which is uh, over there about uh, 400 metres or about a quarter mile from my position. Loads of trucks down here. V-double. There's your Volvo. Couple of Volvos with the dive and the dive rig. One of our logging trucks that's just come back from the paper mill after dropping a load off. Big motor and jack. More trucks. So this is uh, Princess Highway, the old Princess Highway here. Uh, now. Uh, there is a, of course, that the uh, freeway goes around more well, but this is the old Princess Freeway, which uh, used to be the, the direct route from uh, pretty much from Sydney along the coast to uh, Melbourne. Nice motorbike, and there's your garbage truck for your garbage truck fans. You. There's our solo garbo over there. Yes, what has four wheels and flies? That thing over there, garbage truck, man. A white ibis there, locally known as bin chickens. Another one of our trucks over there, B double. All articulated. So I found some new markings on our, some of our rail infrastructure here. We've got a WC Hayes. Western Cullen Hayes Inc. I would imagine that's an American company. Uh, but of course, we still have our Westinghouse, so that some of the uh, stuff is still supplied by Westinghouse. Can't see any safe trans system, so this uh, MWC Hayes may be a similar sort of uh, operation. Write in the comments anyway. There's your Mack truck right there. Special Agent Fox Mulder loves a Mac. Oh, and he's hightailing it, mate. Look at that one. Close view of the hightail. Light power move. Kenworth, all right. So the track speed along here, as he's going across the crossing, is only about 15 kilometers an hour roughly around 10 miles an hour and for the cars the track speed limit is 80 kilometers an hour around 50 miles an hour another big rig uh, here we are in the center reservation here of, of the road i haven't done that one of these ones before so i am wearing my high vis stuff so i stand out wearing orange so it's always uh, good to wear that sort of stuff to make sure that people can see where you are at all times utility pole truck over there's one of our uh, recycling facilities that's uh, clean away over there one of the bigger companies in Victoria getting rid of the rubbish Fully loaded log truck going to the paper mill. There's some byproduct coming back the other way, so he's going down there with the uh, the raw, and someone's come back with some of the uh, byproduct there. So he'll be heading down to where the train's coming from. That log truck. Busy, busy, busy. Logs going in, and the stuff that'll be coming past me very shortly will be the uh, products 
after these logs have been processed. They're huge, uh, those log trains, those log uh, trucks. And uh, there's another truck coming out of the uh, paper mill there with some byproducts. Agro, agro solutions, of course, agricultural solutions. A lot of our farming, of course, around here, dairy farming, sheep farming. Not too much crop farming, but yeah, it's mostly dairy and uh, dairy and sheep. Huge uh, flock of the uh, white ibis up there on that cypress tree there. Once again, like I said, they're locally known as bin chickens. Because they are tempted, uh, they have the temptation for a bin. Alright, freight train ahoy. They're still a long way down. Alright, shout out time. These are some of the people that are helping Special Agent Fox Mulder get to 3,000 subs, which is his uh, goal for 2023. I only need another uh, about 150 odd, just over 150 odd. And uh, yeah, well, uh, thanks to Stretch Limo. Good on you, Eddie. He's uh, put the word out there. Jamie Carlson from SoCal, Southern California. Good on you, mate. He uh, goes by the handle of Slim Onion there on uh, YouTube. And Robin Roberts uh, will uh, end up with a special agent Fox Mulder out at the end for you mate and uh, of course I'll leave a link to uh, Wide World of Trains, Mike from Wide World of Trains in the description a Google Street View Map link in the description and uh, yeah thanks for the great support for all the uh, great Special Agent Fox Mulder fans and uh, supporters there we go Product meets byproduct coming down the track. Okay, so when you're trapped in an old western town, surrounded by a posse, yell out the window, hey Petman, I see you got the like button there with you. And when he Petman's returns is, yeah, we got a whole heap down here. Shoot the like button down and then say, hey Petman, I ain't see you ain't got the like button with you no more. He's slowly closing in. It's got a couple of uh, EMD SD70 ACEs on the front there. Need all that tractive power in Australia. Hot conditions here. We don't get snow or anything like that. So uh, down down here, or well, very rarely anyway. So we need the uh, ones that can uh, withstand the heat. Willaton Ahoy. Uh, quite a uh, huge local company, Willaton R Transport. See he's right through the trees there. Watch the uh, signals. Signals are uh, start here. The gates, they should be about to uh, start going down. So he's only. Uh, Probably doing about maybe 15 mile an hour along that part there. And these uh, crossings are designed to uh, have an algorithm that uh, works out how long it's going to take the train to get to point A to point B. Now he's going to have a whole series of intermodals on the back of him which contain byproducts from the uh, Australian paper mill including rolls and reams of paper of all sorts that's uh, not just uh, paper to write on of course it's all sorts of uh, cardboard type paper a bit of toilet paper serviettes 
tissues, any sort of uh, paper product anyway. See up there, he turned his light off as he pulled up short. We'll go down and have a look. That's why it's short. He's waiting for the uh, VFT to clear the track at 160 kilometers an hour, 100 miles an hour. Nice looking rig over there, B double. So he's pulled up there, waiting because the uh, 1037 towards Trelgan is due any minute. And once he's cleared the track, then uh, the steel horse, or uh, well, sorry, the uh, paper mill train will be actually cleared to go book and jack. It's only just down that far. Empty log truck. Nice. Alright. Track clearance. Green light. Go our gates. Here comes our train. Got a bit of time on track with him because he's not going that fast, so that's always good. Get a bit of a look what's going on. Horn salute, all right. Wide screen mode. <laughs> Friendly engineer wave. There's our intermodal. They don't look that big when you're uh, through the camera, but that's uh, like, uh, yeah. That's standing nearly three times above me. There's a Maersk, pretty common uh, brand. You can uh, watch him going around the corner. He's heading onto the main. Bit of our equipment along the side there. Not a bad size intermodal. They're called intermodals because they uh, not only go on the uh, the back of a truck, they'll go on the uh, back of a train as well as a back of a ship or inside of a ship anyway. Shout out to the Australian Paper Mill, they put good people down there, uh, always willing to help me out when the train's coming, so which is always good. The barcode readers are on the other side of the uh, train. The barcode readers. And you can see some of the symbols. There, they run through uh, certain uh, cameras and such to, uh, just to check the load, so. 
end of train in sight. Hope you recognise some of these containers. Some of them are uh, quite universal. End of train. And there's his end of train device. And you can see him uh, over there going onto the main. Half of Victoria has just been released. Me. So yeah, once he's on the uh, main line there, box mold of fan there, and uh, once he's on the main, sorry, huge amount of traffic. Um, I'll start again. Once he's on the main, he'll uh, track limit. Speed limit will be uh, around about uh, 80 kilometres an hour, maybe 100 kilometres an hour, so roughly about 60 miles an hour at least anyway. So, all right, that was a good one. We'll just watch the, uh, the end of him slip out of sight there. He's uh, heading east. Sorry, he wouldn't be heading east, he's heading west, sorry. <laughs> and he's heading towards Melbourne with a little bit of north on it. So uh, yeah, cool. Very rare train, the paper mill is closing down soon. So the more I can get of these, the better. All right, go ahead and give me a like and a subscribe. Thanking you, fine people. Excuse me. It must be all the truck fumes. All right, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed that, that was pretty cool. We've got a uh, 17 minute video with I think two trains in it. That's not too bad though. All right, that'll be Special Agent Fox Mulder doing a 360 and out.